All right, we're here with Andre. Andre, listen. Hey, if you get a question right, now you're walking away. I got food here, buddy. Hey, <laughs> look. You have to answer these questions correctly before we do it. Oh, I'm, just, I'm getting a little scared. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> All right, we are here at the Central Florida Zoo for this week's This Just In. Behind me, and let me get this right, we have Cotton Top Tamarins. In fact, this is a family of nine. So it's like the Brady Bunch here at the Central Florida Zoo. They are really fun to look at. And this week, I have a special guest joining me on This Just In. Can we bring her in, please? Kirsten O'Connor. It's, it's not a Tamarins, it's Kirsten, unfortunately. But we have uh, gifts to give away. Kirsten's going to be um, Vanna White, if you will, for this week's This Just In. She has given me the glare. I've seen that glare before. It's not a good glare, but we're going to ask you questions anyway. It's okay. First question, Aura, I have for you is why was Publix in the headlines this week? Oh. In today's Consumer Watch, you can soon notice a little change at your local Publix. And this one could be disappointing to a whole lot of people. Publix is testing out not handing out free sample slices at the deli. Because they're not giving out meat samples in the deli anymore. Did you see the update? I did not. They apparently said that was blown out of proportion, but you are correct. That is the right answer. Um, they won having the best subs ever for the 75th year in a row. It's not right. He needs some help. Uh, that I don't know. Did you see the story about the deli and how they were maybe limiting the amount of free samples they were giving out? I did not see that story. What would you think about that, though? Uh, limiting the amount of free samples? Well, you have to. Otherwise, people can just come in and grab handfuls. That's what I do. That's what I do. So you're blaming me? You're to blame. Gosh, it wasn't the pub subs, huh? I don't... It wasn't the pub subs, even though they are really good. They are really good. No, I don't know why Publix was in the news this week. You don't get a pub sub. That was one of my prizes. Chicken tender sub would have been coming your way. Oh, I'm so disappointed now. I'm sorry. I'm kidding, that way. <laughs> Question two. What land is now coming to Disney World? It's opening in May. It is a big year for Animal Kingdom. After years of construction, Disney announced this week a land based on the hit movie Avatar will officially open on May 27th. Uh, don't know that either. James Cameron. Oh. Um, okay. Like aliens and stuff. All right. Um. <laughs> God. God. Kirsten says it's not aliens. It's like, um, there is, all, this land is also based on a music app on your phone. Okay. Pandora. Uh, yes, probably. It's probably that. I gave it to him. Avatar. Okay, that one. Okay. That's it. <laughs> The Avatar exhibit. That's right. Peanut Gallery works. James Cameron. Ring a bell. Avatar. Avatar. Oh, okay. okay. Give that one to you. Clues help, right? It's Pandora. It's Avatar. Avatar. Are you excited? Oh, I am. Yes. A lot of people are. Mm -hmm. Season pass holder. She knows that. Perfect. Ara, right, can you tell me which player from the New England Patriots was in their Super Bowl parade at Walt Disney World this weekend? The tradition continued over at Disney today. The running back James White going to Disney World, a 30-year tradition. Tom Brady. Brady. It wasn't Brady. It was a running back. No idea. It wasn't Tom Brady. Went <laughs> and participated in the Magic Kingdom's parade. He's the only Patriots player I know. That's, I know, it's a trick question. I had to make one hard one. It's all Tom Brady. That's, that's it. That's the only thing I like the Patriots. Tom Brady. <laughs> Me too. I'm right there with you. Mr. White, the running back. Ha <laughs> ha! Jerry knows the sports. I love it. Jerry, we appreciate you playing. It's not just a plain blue shirt. <laughs> it says... She loves it. She says it's nice. There you go. And we have these mouse pads. Not a lot of people use mouse pads anymore, believe it or not. But do you guys think you could find a home for this? George would love it. Okay. George, George, we know you'd love it. There it is. Yeah. New six, getting results. That will work, and I guarantee you, okay, this is 100% cotton. It will shrink.
Kirsten, my swag giver. Vanna White, if you will. Thank you. Executive, executive decision. Okay. Gets both of them. We're going to give her a... How about that? Okay, yes. L a luggage tag. No one's going to have that. And... So this will always remind you to not only watch Channel 6, but also head to our website, clickorlando.com, and go to our Facebook page, facebook.com slash new6. Three plugs right there. What do you think? I'll do that.